metabolism is really just a, a complicated word for a simple process that is when we take our food in our bodies and we convert it into an energy source that works. There are many uh, different hormones in our metabolism or our fuel system. Uh, the two most important ones are really insulin and glucagon. Insulin originates or starts in the pancreas, that little organ just next to the stomach. And then it's going to go out to all the different tissues. And the majority of tissues in the body, especially the tissues of your muscles and your fat cells, are going to use insulin as a signal. And it works almost like a doorman knocking on a door to signal the cell or the little compartments in your body to open up and take in the nutrition so that it can then be used now for energy or stored away later. Glucagon is a different hormone also made in the pancreas, uh, actually in different cells than the cells that are making the insulin. And that hormone actually is gonna go directly to the liver. And it communicates with the liver so that the liver then will either make uh, sugars from any floating around fats or proteins, or if there's a good supply of sugar in the liver, it's actually gonna release it back into the bloodstream. So while the insulin empties the bloodstream of its sugar, the glucagon will stimulate the liver to bring sugar stores up. And so these two hormones work in concert with another, uh, such as a seesaw. When one is high, the other is low, and they try and regulate that blood sugar to a very tight control.